friends, welcome to Rafter Studios. Today I will show you how to use soft tubes, console one, side chain compression and gate in Reaper. So here we have two tracks. The first track is the voiceover and the second one is the music track. What we want is the music track to be compressed while it receives signal from the voiceover track. Something like this. Οι φακές πολλούνται ως ξερά όσπρια, σε σακουλάκια. Τρώγονται μαγειρεμένες και γίνονται σούπα. Μαγειρεύονται με την προσθήκη κρεμμυδιού, καρότου και σκόρμου. Περιέχουν πολλές τραπητικές ουσίες και κυρίως σίδηρο. So, how I did this. First, we go to the console one plugin of the track that we want to be compressed. We go to the pin connector. We select four track channels and VST3 bus size 2 and the one goes into in left, the two into in right and three to side chain. Then we send the voiceover track to three and four on the music track and then we go to console one and to the external sidechain, we select external sidechain to compressor. So let's do the same with the gate. Here we have two bass tracks. The one is the clean DI and the one is the Sunzamp. This is the bass track from Screen Bloody Core bass cover that I did two months ago. Let's hear it. Let's hear it again with the gate bypass. I did the exact same thing. The only thing that I changed is that I sent the bass pre-FX and not post fader and instead of external signal to comp, you set the external signal to shape. The reason that I sent it pre-FX is because I want only the formation of the clean signal. You can do the same with the distorted guitars. You can use the clean DI signal to send the dynamic information to the distorted one, that it's less dynamic, and you can have great results. So, I hope you found this video useful. If you really like this video, please press the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe. And if you have any question or suggestion, leave a comment below. Until then, yasas!